Parade. 15 minutes of music in the modern manner, sweet and slow, light and bright. Produced for your entertainment by the Director of Public Relations of the Australian Army. Featuring Lottie Wilson, the Hammond Organ, and backed by the On Parade Quintets. Men of the Australian Regular Army often see much of the world during their service. Soldiering can take them to many places only the luckiest civilians see, for instance, Japan. Did you know that Australian soldiers were 11 years in the land of Nippon? It all began with the occupation at the end of 1945 and ended as recently as January 1957. They found Japan a fascinating country, although so far from home. Their feelings were usually those of the band who give us, it's all right with me. The Australians found it pleasant in Japan, but the first two years of the occupation was pretty hectic. Given the policing of the southern part of the main island of Honshu, and also the island of Shikoku, the Australians handled 700,000 Japanese repatriates returning to their homes, destroyed thousands of tons of ammunition, explosives, and poison gases. In the demilitarization program, these finds turned up in some of the oddest places. But listen to while as Lottie Wilson plays where or when.
Yes, the early occupation days in Japan were hectic, but as the years went by, these tasks declined. Then followed the grim period of the Korean War, when the forces of Japan formed the base for the Korean operations and a leave centre for many thousands of battle-weary diggers from over the straits. But as the Korean hostilities calmed down, the Australians and Japan had time to look around and observe the interesting country. Here, where the ancient and the modern rub shoulders and 90 million people strive for existence, places have become memories for many thousands of Australians. Tokyo's Bond Street, the Ginza, will always be remembered, and the pleasant camp at Ebisu, Temple Strewn Nikko, and a hundred other places make memories. Wrap up the perfume, candy and flowers And mister, won't you send them to the sweetest of the sweets They're only raindrops in an ocean Just gone right out of sight Compared to my emotions When she kissed me last night And with the perfume, candy and flowers You sent her, how I wish you would wrap up my heart She's going to own it by and by So mister, shall we try a little perfume candy flowers for a start Met the gal at half past nine Took her out to dance and dine Twelve o'clock I held her tight Two o'clock a little kiss goodnight Woke this morning half past eight Skipped my breakfast, couldn't wait Had to rush down to the store Hurry mister, open up that door Wrap up the perfume Candy and flowers and mister Won't you send them to the sweetest of the sweets They're only raindrops in an ocean Just got right out of sight Compared to my emotions When she kissed me last night And with the perfume Candy and flowers You sent her How I wish you would wrap up my heart She's going to own it by and by So, mister, shall we try A little perfume candy flowers for a start Some perfume candy flowers for a start Well, thanks ever so much, Lenny Holmes, for the memories of perfume candy and flowers. Australian soldiers became well known and respected in the land of Nippon. From May 1946, when they provided a ceremonial guard in the Imperial Plaza outside the Emperor's Palace, the digger hat was a familiar sight. The Australian soldier is a hard fighter, but he's by no means hard bitten. The Japanese found this when the boys from the other ranks club in Tokyo took under their wing a Japanese orphanage, provided a Christmas party for the waifs for several years, and presented the orphanage with a piano, radio, clock, and many other amenities the struggling organization could not provide. Many of the Japanese people will remember the Australians for many years to come, and remember them kindly and respectfully. And here now is the quintet with I'll Remember April. <laughs>
And as April is around cherry blossom time in Japan, that's a good note on which to wind up this edition of On Parade. <laughs> Now, this is Jim Berenson saying cheerio from On Parade, produced by the Director of Public Relations of the Australian Army. 